Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a nice 3D resin flower with a new um, resin I got. I ordered from Depoxy at the diamond um, diamond resin and it's, it's a resin um, which is perfect for 3D flowers because it's foolproof. You will see in a few minutes that I do so many mistakes and the outcome will be amazing. So you see, I already prepared my resin. I used some um, golden stones for the middle part and for the outer part. And here's my resin with um, my paste. It's white paste and pink paste. Um, and of course, some drops, only three to four drops of this um, white alcohol ink. Um, so we will draw circles and um, then draw with a toothpick the pattern of the flower. And you, you will uh, see in a few seconds that um, I will do so many mistakes. Um, I tried to, to draw nice circles, but it's getting so blobby and so irregular. And uh, I was dying at this moment because I thought, okay, it's not going to work. But you will see this resin is foolproof. And um, the good thing is you can use a lot of paste. Usually I try to um, use only a tiny bit of paste to get a result between transparent and opaque. So not fully opaque, but here it doesn't matter. Take, take some drops of your paste and it will work. Um, you see very irregular circles um, and usually it would get an uh, awful result. Um, same with the pink paste and you will see that I will touch the surface of my resin with a cup and I thought oh no this part will get terrible. Um, I tried to, to improve my technique but this led to to my yeah to my accident I would say. Um, and you see it's a lot of colored resin which I pour and here you get my mistake um, a big blob of the pink and I uh, touched my white uh, but I thought okay I don't care let's let's try it and you will see it doesn't matter what, <laughs> no matter what you do, it will work. It's amazing. This resin is so amazing. I love it. I ordered, I think now eight kilograms because I, yeah, I love it. It's perfect for 3D flowers. Um, so, and now I will do something I never do. Um, I add some more white paste. Usually it would blob to the ground and um, I thought, okay, now I did so many things wrong. I don't care. I add some more layers of the, of the white because there was so much white left and I thought, well, why not? What should happen? And you will see at the end that it worked so well. So in a few seconds, I will draw the, um, the pattern with my toothpick, the standard, standard pattern. Um, first I thought, okay, maybe I will do another one, but I think this pattern always gives the best outcome. So first I started at the different corners and then I um, then I draw some more petals from the middle part or to the center and then from the center to the outer part and that's it. So now from the center to the outer part of the mold. I used this resin I think two times before I did this one here and um, it worked so well. I thought okay so nothing can go wrong and yeah so no matter what you do <laughs> it will work. 
So now we have our star shape and then we have to wait until tomorrow, a little swirl in the middle, and wait until tomorrow to see the final result. Of course I need to use my torch to remove the air bubbles. And that's it. So tomorrow you can see the nice result. So I think we're we are finished now. So guys, see you tomorrow. Bye bye. bye. Welcome back everyone. So it's the next morning. You see my resin is still a little bit bendy or very bendy, but I think we can demold it and um, then bring bring it into a nice um, into a nice shape of a bowl. But first, let's let's check the result. I really love this outcome. So you see, it worked so well, um, and you don't see the accident with the color, and you don't see that I touched that I touched the resin with my cup and so on. It's amazing. It's so foolproof, this resin. So um, I decided to bring it into a, nice, um, into a nice creative form using my little balls or half balls or whatever. I think, no, it's the, the round ones, yes. And um, so I will speed up this, um, this video in a few minutes because it takes some time to um, to do this here and if you want to see the final result then um, you can skip this part so um, let's speed it up At the end you will see the final result. Bye bye and thank you for watching.